it is. So there's already music into it. But let's say we want to add. Hello guys, welcome to AI Plus More. And in this video, I will be showing you how you can add music to your YouTube Shorts videos on while well, using your PC or your desktop. And I have to tell you, it's a very easy process to do. And you just need to follow me every step of the way. And I'm sure I won't take much of your time. And within two minutes, we will be done. Hopefully less. So first of all, you need to go to your YouTube channel and then go to your videos here on the left side corner of the screen and then you'll be sent to the YouTube studio where you can access again your your content now let's find the YouTube shorts video that we've uploaded here this one so this one video I've already edited music into it, it. Is, what is it so there's already music into it but let's say we want to add what you need to do is let's go back here to our video details and click on the editor on the left side of the screen here and now what we'll find is an editor a built-in editor online found in youtube yes this is an editor but the thing is it's not famous because it's e the editor isn't really that useful you only have these five options to choose from and they're not really gonna change much about the video but what matters is is the trimming the blurring, the audio here, it's all about avoiding copyright to YouTube. All about making sure that the video is within the community rules. Alright, now you want to add your music. And it's obvious now, you should have been reading it ever since earlier. Oh, audio! Why is he not clicking it? I will click it now, I'm so sorry. I made it your wait. Click it, edit, and now you will be able to access all of the music found in the YouTube audio library app not all if you want to access all of it you can find it here they will then give you an entire library of music that's non-copyrighted no royalty and you can download it and use it in any of your videos the only downside that i would say is that they're not really better compared to the other kind of background music that you will find in other places premium services where you have to subscribe i still believe that the music that they have there is much better than what audio library has to offer for us but if you're a beginner i think it's good enough so let's say we want to add one of um the music here and what good thing is if you add if you added a, a music from the built-in editor into your video I want to remove it you can actually did this is something that i've added a while ago and now i want to remove it what you need to do only is just to click here and click remove and now the video it is what doesn't have any music anymore that's so cool and now if you want to add a video a music into your video just click anything that you want here add click on add you can even play it to Listen to it the per bit, the preview, per se. See, that's cool, right? All right. Now, let's say we want to add trabaja duro vega duro into our video. And all you need to do is just click on add, and here we go. It's now part of our video. But when we play it, we can hear the audio of the video itself. And what you need to do is click here adjust mix level to make sure that it's balanced or it's not overpowering the audio of the video and when you play it again it is what is it as you can see it doesn't really change the volume not entirely but it balances the entire video to make sure that there's space for the other audio over the rest so i would say the mix the mix level thing it's not really that efficient when it comes to editing the audio of your video if you really want to edit your video better to add audio or music it's much better to use softwares that's downloaded on your pc on your desktop on your laptop to edit this video before you upload it or you can just download it download it using what i have but that would mean uploading the video all over again, 
but should sacrifice the views that it already has. I would advise that you should make sure that the video has been edited properly before you upload it so you do not waste any precious time. But that's all I can say. Once again, thank you for watching. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And make sure to comment down below any thoughts or suggestions that you would like us to make in the future. Thank you so much.